Hi, you guys. My name is Megan Christensen, and I'm the author of Wally and the Sweet Mountain Candy Factory. And I am so excited to be with you today. You're probably wondering, what's that super weird thing that she's got on? Well, let me tell you. This is my candy costume. And I love to wear it when I go and read books to children just like you. But we have a problem today. I'm all the way in Ohio, even though I wish I could be sitting at the edge of your bed. But I really want you to be able to wear my candy costume today because it's really good for dancing. So I have an idea. What if you close your eyes really, really tight? Close them, close them, close them, and use your imagination. Keep them closed, keep them really, really closed, close them tight, 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 tight. Now open them. Are you wearing it? Is it on you? Let me see. Let me see if it's on you. If it's on you, do a little dance. I think it's on you. I see. You look really good in it. I like that. Okay, so I'm so happy to be with you today and I'm even happier to be reading my book because I've never read my book over Facebook before. You are the very first one who gets to hear my book, and I'm so glad that it's you. So, I think I'm going to get started, and hopefully we have some friends here with us. So, this book is called Wally and the Sweet Mountain Candy Factory, and it's written by me, Megan E. Christensen, and it's illustrated by my friend. His name is Pardeep Mera, and he lives all the way over in India but he is really good at drawing. So let's do this. So something about my book that you need to know is you have to use a lot of imagination while we're reading and also we're gonna become candy makers together. Are you ready? Okay, meet Wally. Can you say hi to Wally? He has some super cool hair, really big dreams and he loves Candy. I love candy too. Wally combs his hair the same way every single day, but today it has to be perfect. Today his biggest dream is about to come true. What do you think it is? Wally has always dreamed of being a candy maker, just like his dad and his dad's dad and his dad's dad's dad. That's his great, great grandpa. This is Wally's family tree. What? Does his family live in a tree? No, it's just a drawing. And it shows all the people in your family. You have one of these too. So Wally is so excited to become a candy maker. Is there something you're really excited to be? Or something you're excited to do? Today, it's Wally's very first day to carry on his family's tradition and become part of their legacy. It's his first day to work at his family's Sweet Mountain Candy Factory. Now, I used kind of a big word there, the word legacy. Do you know what that means? Well, legacy is something that's been handed down from an older family member. Something that's important, and to them, it's the candy factory. So while he eats his breakfast, pancakes are his favorite. I hope you like breakfast too. He does his secret handshake with his sister. Woohoo! And after strapping on his skis, he's on his way. Oh, he's got the whole neighborhood cheering him on. Let's cheer him on with him. Good luck, Wally! Go, Wally! You're awesome! Today's your day. And look, he's almost there. He just has one more mile until there's candy. Okay, this is where I need you to use your imagination too, okay? Wally arrives at the factory. He takes a deep breath. <gasps> he wiggles his jitters out. And with a pep in his step, he flings open the factory doors. And who's there? Wally's grandpa. He's waiting for him with a brand new uniform and a big grin. His uniform is one candy making hat and two candy hammers. What do you think he's gonna do with those? Okay, so let's become candy makers. So let's put on our hat. You guys ready? Let's do this. 
when Wally arrives at his station, he is so excited. He feels like his bones are dancing. He is ready. Before Wally's turn, some important candy making steps have to be done though. So step number one is to mix the candy ingredients. So this is our friend Peter. This is his job and he mixes the ingredients. So can you get your big spoon and your bowl and let's help Peter, okay? Mix and mix and mix. And while you're mixing, I'm gonna put in some sugar, maybe some syrup and water. Mmm, what flavor should we make? Cotton candy, that one's my favorite. Let's put in some cotton candy and we're gonna make it hot pink just like Peter. So the candy has to be mixed and mixed and mixed some more until it's just right. Then, after all the ingredients are mixed and mixed and mixed, it's time for step number two, shape the candy. And this is done by Max and Tig. And their job is really fun. Are you ready? Their job is to stretch and stretch and stretch the candy. Can you do that with me? Stretch the candy. And after it's all stretched, then it's Howie's job. He's next in line on the conveyor belt. And his job is to roll and roll and roll the candy. And next is Simmy. Simmy's job is to sprinkle, 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 sprinkle onto the candy. How does your candy look? Is it all ready? Is it flat and sprinkled and looking nice? Let's see what's next. After all the stretching and the rolling and the sprinkling, it's time for step number three. I'm not very good at this. Bake the candy. This is done by Raz. Raz, he ever so carefully puts the candy into the hot, hot oven and then he sets a timer. And Wally is next. Wally's job is the best of all. It's exciting, it's fun, and it's a little bit silly. Are you ready? Wally's job is step number four. Hammer the candy into tiny little pieces. When Wally hears a loud ding, the candy is ready to be hammer, 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 hammered. That's Wally's job. Can you hammer with him? He does it in these tiny little pieces. But then after Wally's job is finished, it's time for the last step, step number five. And that is to package and mail the candy for you to eat it. The factory is everything Wally dreamed it would be. He is feeling so good until, uh-oh, everything is out of control. The candy starts racing down the belt way too fast. Then faster and faster. Everyone is having to work double time. Oh no, can you do it with them? Stretch, 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 roll, 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 sprinkle, 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 sprinkle. And Wally, ding, hammer, 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 ding, hammer, 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 ding, hammer, hammer, hammer. Oh, Wally and his friends can hardly keep up. Oh, why is the conveyor belt going so fast? Wally stretches his tired arms. I bet you're tired too. And he goes to investigate. He is going to solve this problem himself. Hmm, what does he find? 